Oh, very excited. I mean, the kids are excited. The community is excited. Uh, it's great being back into the playoffs. Uh, the kids have fought hard. That new league has been awesome, uh, preparing us for the playoffs, preparing us for uh, week 11. And, you know, we've done a, you know, the kids have just, like I said, did everything needed and everything possible to get to this point. Well, first of all, I'm glad that we're hosting it because else we'd be traveling all the way down the river. A two hour drive, not a good drive. And plus we'd be playing on a Saturday afternoon because they don't have lights. So it's good being home. Uh, you know, it's, it's really good winning that uh, Week 10 game because that really uh, boosts us into a home game. Um, you know, Bel Air is a great team. I mean, very well coached. They were in the playoffs last year. A uh, lot like us, you know, battle-tested, uh, ready to play, good playoff team. Uh, you know, if you look on paper, it's a typical 4-5 matchup, you know, great 4-5 matchup uh, for the playoffs. I, um, you know, their coach has been there. He understands what's going on. Their kids are tough kids. Uh, they run the ball. They can throw the ball. They do a little bit of both, but uh, their defense is the main part of their, their game. They play great defense down there. You know, we got to play great, uh, first of all. When you get in the playoffs, there's no bad teams. You've got to play great. Uh, we got to execute good offensively. We've got to be able to move the ball. Uh, running the ball and passing, we got to mix it up a little bit so we can keep them on their heels. Uh, defensively, we got to stop their running game. they got a really good running back, uh, Cole Porter, and uh, does a good job uh, running off tackle, runs wide. Uh, they'll even put him in a wildcat a little bit, so uh, we got to stop him. That, that He's their biggest threat to us uh, when we're on defense. This team really wanted to bounce back, and uh, that's sort of been our motto is to bounce back. Uh, we wanted to get back into the playoffs. We wanted to get back into a uh, – bouncing back into a league again because we've been independent for the last two years. So uh, we just really wanted to bounce back and get back into, like I said, the playoffs and back into uh, where – we want to be. The league is what prepared us for it. I mean, our, our, the league is a phenomenal league, the NE8. Uh, my goodness, we got, uh, what, four teams in, five teams in, uh, five teams in out of the NE8. So, I mean, it's just the, the league has prepared us for this playoffs. And, you know, Bel Air is a lot like uh, your Hubbard. It's a lot like your Struthers. It's a lot like your Gerards. I mean, they're very similar. So uh, it has prepared us, and I think we're ready. And uh, but we got to come out and play hard on Saturday night. They're feeling really good right now because yeah, you beat a great program like Hubbard, uh, beat a great program like Struthers, who both are in the playoffs uh, in Division Four, and you know that gives us a lot of confidence going into this. But they also realize that guess what? Bel Air's play great teams too, and we got to come in playing our very best right now, and we got to execute to perfection. The playoffs are different. It's a whole nother season, and that's how we look at it. You know, you got your non-league, now you got your league play, and now you get your non-league, uh, you get your playoffs. So if you do well in those first two parts, you get rewarded by getting to play a week 11 and whatever. So, I mean, it is, it's, it's still exciting. I don't care if it's been three years or 25 years, it's still exciting.